Hello! How the fudge you doing? Hey guys, Dfield here with Insanity, and today we are bringing you another Factions Let's Play episode. Alright guys, sorry we have not been recording recently. We actually have been very busy with our finals with school and, uh, you know, just a lot of busy plans uh, that's been happening lately, so... I apologize for the lack of videos, but we will be uploading every two or three days um, during the winter break. So yeah, look forward to that, guys. Um, Factions Green is resetting very soon. Um, we're just doing some uh, pre-world generations before we actually reset the server. And um, I got permission from the owner that I could just copy my base over to the new one, as I have not been raided yet. And um, he looked at my base and he's like, yeah, you spent a lot of time on it, and you, you can just copy it over. So yeah, I'm just going to end up copying my this base over to the new factions world just to save some time i mean i'm probably going to end up changing up a lot of the stuff and how everything is made but for the sake of uh the videos for the sake of just time um i'm, I'm going to just copy most of this stuff over so you know so we don't really have to spend as much time rebuilding everything exactly the way it was like this all right so our recent updates we have the head plugin now on the server so we have this head plugin make sure you guys go pvping and you can start collecting the heads of your fellow friends. So for this episode, um, we are going to start to build our pigment grinder, pigment farm. All right, so we we built a room over here to the right of our iron golems. Look at our pretty iron golem farm. It's all complete all the way through. Some of them actually don't spawn because you do get too far from it, but you know, it's whatever. It doesn't make a big deal to us. And yeah, so this is our room so far. Do you want to buy the spawners? Uh, we'll buy the spawners after we dig it out. So, hold on. What, what, what are we planning on doing, Matthew? Are we are we doing, like, a, a row of pigmen? Like, where are we killing them from and what? Uh, we can make an elevator. So we're gonna make... Doesn't it have to be, like, an 8x8 eight eight room or something? Uh, sure. Alright, so how are we gonna do this? So, let's eat. Look at Matthew using his super breaker. I'll help you out a bit. Don't I... I have to, like, dig up, don't I? Um. So, hold on. Let me see how we're gonna do this. So we're gonna have, let's plan this out first. So do we have any glass? So I, this can be our killing walkway here, Matthew. This can be our killing walkway here. Where? Just this just wall right here. So then the, the pigmen will be in front of us here, technically. Are we gonna do it where we kill them from one spot or they can walk? Uh, like, what do you wanna do? Wait. Yeah, we haven't really planned this out. We're kinda just recording as we, as we think of everything, so. We so it needs to be eight, so up to here. So. so up to here. And then the elevator has to go. How many is this across? One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's ten across. Shouldn't it shouldn't be a straight line though, Matthew? Shouldn't oh, yeah. it be like a like a flowing, like flowing towards the middle and then going up? One. I think we should have. I think we should have it floating the opposite direction, actually. So like hit from here, like this, and then we'll have the water. We'll have the water sources on this side, and then push them. And then the elevator can be on this back side. Oh, so what we're planning on doing is like, whoa, Matthew. What I the? think you need to raise this. What do you mean? Oh yeah, because we're right underneath our armory. So basically, you're gonna you're gonna do a normal creep elevator or like a monster mob spawner elevator that raises them up 23 blocks and then from there well you want to buy the spawners we'll buy the spawners later you're still planning out the room why do you need the spawners if you're not even done yet okay i need more stone hold on Let me grab some stone um yeah so this is another tutorial for you guys you guys have been uh wondering how to make these sort of stuff so we're making this quick tutorial this this actually the same exact spawn room can be applied to zombies it can be applied to skeletons like those types of farms so make sure um make sure you guys take note of all of this and use it for your future farms all right so how many layers do we have to add matthew oh, just one just one all right so there's that and then so wait, this is this has to be eight across. No, Matthew, the water source has to be this way, because like if this is the spawner, like it's, pretend this is the spawner, they have to flow back here, and then like say pretend these like this. This is gonna be the elevator going up, and then it'll go this way, so then we can kill it here. No, I could just make it here, and then elevator here, and then it'll just drop here. Yeah, but then you want to see them flowing into the back room. Like, we're going to make it so that you can see the, the mobs are spawning. Like, it's just for looks. Okay. So we need to make it this way. 
Well, is this eight? Oh god, I don't want to break it and cause water. So one, two, three, four, yeah, five, this is six, it. seven, eight. So let's, let's put. So break the glowstone. We we could put glass after. Yeah. And Oops. Then. All right. So and then how do you make that thing so then it goes in the middle? I go like this. You know how to do that, and then. So is this an eight by eight room? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right. So then they all flow into the middle here. Here, I'll start building. Uh, what's your cord so we? Can oh, what the heck is this? Oh, this is one of our. Uh, you, we could destroy our, this. Yeah, but this is one of our rooms that we're planning on building in the future. Oh, that's the Matthew. Watch out because that's our fishing room right there. All of the redstone for the fishing room is like right there. Is it fine if it's just like this short? Yeah. Alright, let's put this here. <laughs> oh yeah, I destroyed the redstone for here. It's fine, wait, move. Move, you move. Let me let me jump up here so I can Yeah, we're just gonna have to move this over there. So I'll just destroy this just right now. Okay, now we're gonna have like starting the water here. We need to we're gonna move our fishing rooms anyway, right? Yep. Alright, so so that's the top of the you water. You want to do it? No? Oh, yeah, let me, get, I'm, let me. I'll just climb up. Hold on, I need to kill the sign. I'll climb up and then. Oh, I'm lagging. Oh, I just lagged down, man. Just mind that again. Okay, hold on. Here's our fishing room. So we'll just kill this fishing room. We'll make another one. It doesn't matter. No big deal. Actually, I kind of want to make this out of stone so everything looks pretty. Alright, I'm coming. Oh, uh, wait. What's that bottom floor? I need that the number. Oh. Matt. <gasps> well, I told you not to do it. Just, we need water. We need water. I That's have water. ice. Okay, well, give me a, drop me ice. Oh, okay. So I can do it on the way up. Oh. Alright, guys. We are back. Uh, sorry about that. We accidentally showed our cords, so I had to, <laughs> I had to cut the video right there. And then I... Uh, we're gonna restart basically from what we were talking about. So Insanity's making the elevator going up that way. So we're planning on having the creeps or the zombie pigmen land on this spot. So we have to go 36 blocks up because this is the 20 or this is the 13th block once I looked at my cords off of camera. So I have to go 36, basically 36 blocks going straight up. Or yeah, going to the Y coordinate of 36. And I did that off camera because I don't want to show you guys our cords and let you guys know exactly where we're at. So, yeah, are you almost at the top, Matthew? Yeah, I'm at the top. Yeah, at the top. All right, just mine across that, and then you should you should get to the thing. And then I'm gonna block this off so then they don't really escape here. So, so it's a very simple mechanism of how to do these rooms. So basically, all of this room is gonna be filled with the zombie pigment grinders or zombie pigment spawners. And what the, what's going to happen is they're going to flow to the middle of this current. And then all zombies and all mobs, they automatically jump in water. So they're going to climb up this elevator like so. So they're going to climb up this elevator. Wait, and this no. elevator will bring them up 23 blocks. So if this elevator goes... What the heck was that? If this elevator goes up 23 blocks, this is the 23rd block. And then what's basically going to happen is they're going to flow this way. Yeah, and then understand. this... This drop right here is going to be a 23 block drop going all the way down. Ah! <laughs> I messed up. Hold on. What do you mean you messed up? It's going to be a 23 block drop going all the way down, basically. And then this is... Mad Insanity has to fix this, but this is what's going to happen. It's going to just drop down here, and they're going to land on this platform right here. And then we will be able to kill them without them killing us. Oh my gosh, Matthew. What did you do? Uh, I got to block this off. I can't even do anything. All right, here we go. Here we go. This always happens when we record. There's always like something that just goes wrong. I'm dead. And then... No, you're not. Two hearts. You have two hearts. <laughs> you're lucky I put that there. And then we're gonna kill him here. Or... Yeah, this is the kill. This we is can the have kill. A here. So what are we gonna have here? Like a half slab? We can yeah. just have like a half slab here. Here, I'll go get a half slab. I think and then there's we can... people in our base. Who is that? Oh, this might be our allies. 
Oh, it's a, <laughs> it's a cat. <laughs> There's it's Pello's cat, guys. He's just guarding the door. <laughs> All right. Uh, let me get a half slap. Matthew, go continue. Did you did you finish the top of the elevator already? Yeah. That was it. That was done. Mm -hmm. It's basically done. So yeah. Um, let's Block go back to. Breaking out of sync. I got kicked. You got kicked. It's probably just a little bit of the server lag. We fixed the majority of the lag. There's some short lag spikes here and there, but honestly, it doesn't really affect it too much. So um, oh my god, I just freaking blocked the water source. Okay, hold on. Uh, do you have another? Oh, I have ice. Okay, that's fine. Uh, do you, can you get some glass from the shop or ch check our chest, the I glass chest? Do you have it? Okay. So put glass here, and then we'll have like these as the lookouts. Supposed to be like this. You want to place, uh, break the box off, um, I'll go to the Aldo Warp shop. I actually have about 2 million from selling my iron ingots and selling stuff I got from fishing. So we'll be able to buy, I think we'll be able to buy 4 spawners right now. Yeah, they're 500,000, so the price is a little bit steep, but you know, you're going to be able to farm up god apples easily after you have this farm set up. So we're going to buy some of these. So I bought 4. Hopefully these work because we've had, we've been having some problems with the, uh, the the spawner plugin, but hopefully we fix it. Also, if you guys haven't noticed, I have two decisions basically. All right, so I'm trying a new wall design at our main base, and what do you guys like? Do you guys like this new design that I put on the right side? So I'm either gonna make it this design, or do you guys like this original like pillar design here? So uh, make sure you guys leave a like or a comment on which one you guys prefer. And uh, we'll make sure to uh, implement that into our next, into our next video. Uh, recording. All right. So there's our spawner group. Matthew, you freaking didn't leave something for me, so I could go in there. Hold on. Why is this not breaking? There we go. Um. Where do you want to place it? Just two. It has to be two away from the wall, right? Just any. I don't care. It doesn't matter really. Let's do two away from the wall. There you go. It's working. Yeah. There goes the first pigman. There goes the first pigman, guys. So what's gonna happen is they're gonna walk into this elevator, go up 23 blocks, and hopefully this is 23 that we counted correctly. And um, they shouldn't die. Uh, they shouldn't. They shouldn't die if they land have here. A piston that yeah, they, they shouldn't die if they land here. Just give them a minute. They'll take a while to actually float over there. We'll put one for now in case we had to fix it. Matthew, this this, this shouldn't all be glass. Only the viewing. This looks stupid. Oh God! I let the water in. Oh. Oh, they're dying. Oh, some of them are dying. Some of them aren't. Dying. So there's our first gold ingots, guys. Uh, let me. Oh, whoa. Oh. oh yeah, Matthew. We're gonna have to. We might have to change it because look, they're gonna start flowing towards us. That's what I said. Oh, okay. I see why you wanted to do that now. We could change that later. What happened? They just disappeared. <laughs> I don't know. What the heck was that? But yeah, guys, this is the ma this is the basic idea of this farm. Just uh, a water elevator going up, all the way going up 23 blocks, and then a dropping just, hole look, that basically drops in 23 me. blocks. Yeah, so uh, that's gonna be it for today's episode, guys. It was a quick episode, just a quick tutorial. It's not very hard to make. So if you guys need help with anything, make sure you just PM me or leave a comment, leave a message, and uh, I'll try to help you guys if this is this. a hard design for you guys to do. And uh, watch, yeah, this watch, is a, uh, what? What are you doing, Matthew? There's an insanity kill him. All right, guys, thank you for watching. Uh, make sure you like, leave a like and a comment. Uh, we do appreciate it. Um, oh my God, Matt, they're gonna get through. <laughs> <laughs> they nearly got out. Uh, thank you guys for watching, and uh, we will be recording more shows in the future. Don't worry. Thank you guys for sticking with us. Um, we hit 400 subscribers in like a month, so that's really great news for us. Um, yeah, that's basically it for today. Uh, if you guys want more tutorials, tell me what you guys want to see. Tell me what you guys want to know. 
and I'll be more than happy to make a tutorial for that. I've got a couple tutorials on how to make the fishing room and I actually probably will end up doing a tutorial for that video or for that specific room in the near future. So yeah, uh, thank you for watching and uh, we will see you guys later. Bye bye.